And now I would like to welcome to the stage Laura Belinskis, who's the Digital Marketing Manager for Subway, and David Galante from Movivity. Hi there, everyone. Thanks so much for joining us today. So Dave and I have had been here for a couple of days, as I'm sure many of you have as well. And we've spent some time working really hard. And we've also yeah, we've also spent some time exploring Barcelona. And in each of our stops, we've done selfies. So it only feels right that we start this off by doing a selfie. So <laughs> all right, Barcelona, everyone. Yay! All right. All right. Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, guys. So uh, I'm excited to talk to you all about uh, Subway's uh, vision and roadmap for RCS. But before we really get into that, what I want to start by talking about is how we've been utilizing SMS as a platform to drive traffic into our restaurants. So in partnership with Mobivity, uh, the company that Dave is with, uh, we've developed a very robust SMS um, subscription-based platform. So it launched originally back in 2015, and since that time, uh, we've acquired over 5 million opt-in members. So these are guests that are finding out about our program either in restaurant, online, but opting in to be receiving weekly deals from us that are driving foot traffic back into the restaurant. Uh, not only do we have this very robust audience, but these people are actually staying in the program, which is obviously one of the most important things. So we have an 85% retention rate. Uh, this exceeded the benchmarks and expectations that we had set for ourselves. So we're really excited about that. And then when we look about at the audience that we're engaging with, we actually have data that validates that they are actually returning more. So they are returning at a 26% higher rate. They're spending more coming in. So they're spending around 13% more and they're purchasing around 15% more units actually when they're coming in as well. And so this is all based on transactional data. And we did decide to conduct a test with an, a new base of opt-in members to validate that these numbers were actually not just coincidental, but like an, a, a true trend coming from their SMS opt-in. So when we conducted that test, we looked at a guest's behavior four months before they opted into the SMS program, and then four months after. And the data that we saw coming out of this validates the data that I showed you before. They're ordering more, they're spending more from a monetary perspective, and they're purchasing more products with us. So with that said, we have this robust audience. It's been a, a tremendous benefit to Subway in driving our sales numbers. And when we think about what the next step is to amplify this even further, RCS is a natural next step and a great fit for us. So about a year ago, we got a call from Mobivity, who's been a great partner to us. And they said, listen, we've been working with Google. Google is developing a version of RCS that they're referring to as RBM. We'd love to get Subway involved and participating in this new technology. So actually we ha just launched this past month our first test with the RCS technology. So we took a population of RBM enabled Android users on the Sprint network. We suppressed them from their normal SMS messages that we had been sending them. And instead we sent them a more rich communication uh, through RBM and delivered their offer to them in this more engaging format. From there on out, the redemption process that the guests had to go through was consistent with that actual SMS process. So the main difference here is that initial, initial engagement and more interactive touch point. So this test is still active in the market right now, so we don't have final results, but I can tell you that our engagement rates are much higher than they were with the traditional SMS program. And when I say that, we're not only looking at click-through rates and redemptions, but actual conversions and sales. So this is uh, one great use case of how we can be utilizing this technology to drive innovation within our business. And with that, I'm going to turn it over to Dave, who's going to give you a demo of another use case that uh, we think will be a strong opportunity for Subway. And so I hope that you not only find this exciting, but I hope it makes you hungry as well. And I hope you all go purchase Subway after this demo. <laughs> Perfect. Thank you, Laura. Wonderful. So is Laura 
Jared mentioned, uh, can we switch to the... Perfect. Uh, do the live feed. Oh, there it is, okay. So we have um, two kind of paths here. So we talked about uh, the live sprint, uh, the live trial and sprint. So thank you to Sprint for, for uh, helping us with that. This is the new offer uh, that you would see on the Sprint network. So the, 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 the kind of the normal text offer has been replaced with this more rich, engaging view. And then after this um, offer is shown, the entire redemption flow is exactly the same. So this is like, like Laura said, this is in production right now. This is live um, on the Sprint network for um, a select few number of customers. Now, the future of this is coupling marketing messages with mobile commerce. So with this demo, we're showing that we can use live data from Google Maps to find a subway near uh, our current location. So I'll drop the pin uh, where I am right now. And then the Mobility platform is going to look for subways that are within my, my radius. So given my location, uh, there are three different subways that are relatively close. Maybe cab ride. Close enough Close to go enough. after this. After that. Yeah. We're, all, we're all getting hungry, yeah. Two point, all right, it's miles, but we can do kilometers. That's great. So I'll, I'll pick that one. And now the menu system, the menu experience is the same thing you would have, you would have inside the store itself. So sandwiches, salads, sides, cookies, desserts. We've took, taken the entire menu and just put it inside the native RCS client. So I could just go ahead and order my, my BMT. And I'm actually gonna interrupt you quickly, Dave, I yes. apologize, but one of the primary pillars of the Subway brand and experience is customization. So it was really important for us as we were thinking about how this technology could work, that we would be offering the guests an experience similar to that of when they actually go into the restaurant or they're using our app. And so with, in partnership with Mobivity, we've really been able to deliver against that here in this format. And then the other thing that I want to add is long term, our goal is to have all of this content personalized. So when we think about what type of subs we would displaying, be displaying to you, we would uh, display subs that we know that you're purchasing. I don't, oh, it is working. Okay. <laughs> purchasing often. Uh, and then we would also try and upsell you to, to more expensive subs. Absolutely. So. So this is, this is the first version of this, uh, and we're looking forward to adding more things. Of course, as in any experience at Subway, there's always a meal deal um, opportunity. So I'll go ahead and pick my drink as well. Uh, and then this is kind of where we really want to see another uh, development with Google is, is online payments. So once, Apple, so once uh, Google Pay is available, uh, we can finish this entire order uh, using our, our, our tokenized credit cards. So here we go. That's a total with, with, the, uh, with the deal selected. And this is where the API would come in and, and complete the purchase. And that's it. So thank you so much for your attention, and uh, we'll be around for questions. Thank you.